In this video, I'll show you how you can create a drop down menu in WordPress. This is pretty easy. I'll refresh your memory or I'll explain how you can do it if this is your first time. So here's a basic menu that we're going to create. Now to do this, we need to go to our WordPress dashboard. Now, once you're on your dashboard, you want to go ahead and go to appearance, then go to menus. Now, once you're in your menus, you probably have a primary menu already. Now, my menu consists of the home page. Now we can add pages under this home page or we can add pages under another page. So right here, you've got all of your pages. Now, obviously you need to have your pages created or you can also add posts under it as well. Now, what we're going to do, I'm going to go ahead and add a marketing page to this menu. So we'll click marketing, then we'll click add to menu. If we save this menu, this is going to act as like a page. So if we refresh this, we'll see home and marketing. Now, let's say we wanted to have a drop down menu under marketing. So now what we can do, we can go to our pages or we can go to our posts and we can go ahead and select them all and then add them to the menu. So let's say all of these posts need to go under the marketing page. So let's click add to menu and it will add them. Now, these will just act as normal pages and they will kind of like line up here. Or if you wanted to attach them to the marketing page, we'll click on this downwards arrow and we can choose here if we want to have them under marketing. So click under marketing. You can see here how it's gone under the marketing page. Same for this post here. Let's click it and we'll click under marketing. Now we can save this menu. And once we've done that, if we refresh, we should now have these posts appear under the marketing page. So that's pretty much how you need to do it. You can do this for any pages that you'd like. So let's say I wanted to add the SEO page. We could just bring this under home and you can see here we need it to go under home just like this at the side. And now the home button should have a drop down menu as well. So that's how to do it. I hope that quick video helped you out.